Hello today's video we have the following content. The career support and business layout behind Liu Yifri, Yang Mi, and Zhao Liying. In the dazzling entertainment starry sky, Liu Yifri, Yang Mi, and Zhao Liying are like three dazzling stars. They have not only created countless classic roles on the screen with their extraordinary acting skills, winning the love and admiration of hundreds of millions of viewers, but also written their own legendary chapters with their unique business vision and exquisite layout on the journey of career development. Liu Yifri, who is known as the fairy descending from heaven, has become the fairy sister in the minds of countless people with her cold and unworldly temperament and solid acting skills since she entered the entertainment industry. Under the careful cultivation of Red Star Wu, Liu Yifri not only maintained the purity and pursuit of art, but also made steady progress in the business map. Although she did not choose to build an independent studio, relying on the strong resources and precise planning of Red Star Wu, she not only consolidated her position in the film and television industry, but also successfully expanded her personal brand to a wider range of fields. Liu Yifri knows that close cooperation with the team can enable her to achieve greater value output while maintaining her personality. This wise choice allows her to find that perfect balance between art and business. As one of the founders of Jiaxing Media, Yang Mi's story is a model of a gorgeous transformation from an actor to an entrepreneur. From palace to eternal love, Yang Mi has not only won wide recognition from the audience with one hit drama after another, but also set off waves in the capital market. She not only knows how to use her star effect to attract resources for the company, but also shows excellent leadership and strategic vision. After leaving Jiaxing, Yang Mi set up her own studio and further consolidated her position in the industry. Her success is not only a victory of acting skills and appearance, but also the result of keen capture and precise grasp of business opportunities. Looking at Zhao Liying again, this inspirational goddess who came out of the rural area of Langfang, Hebei, tells us with her story, dreams and efforts can cross all boundaries. On the road of acting, Zhao Liying has proved her strength and talent with high-quality works such as The Journey of Flower and The Story of Minglin. In the business field, she has shown extraordinary business acumen. As one of the shareholders of Strawberry Pictures, Zhao Liying invested with a unique vision. As the company grew and expanded, her assets also rose. In addition, she also joined Hessen Media as a partner, working hand-in-hand -hand with many well-known artists to explore new boundaries in the entertainment industry. Zhao Liying's success is the best interpretation of small people can also achieve big dreams. The stories of these three actresses are not only the course of personal struggle, but also a vivid portrayal of how contemporary women can bloom in both the acting career and the business field. They use their own experiences to tell us, while pursuing artistic dreams, we must also have the courage to explore the infinite possibilities of business. Whether you choose to lean on a big tree for shade, or start your own business, or work together to create brilliance, the key is to find the most suitable development path for yourself and work hard to move forward. In the future, we have reason to believe that Liu Yifri, Yang Mi, and Zhao Liying will continue to shine in their respective fields, using their unique charm and talent to bring more touching and surprising moments to the audience, and inject more vitality and creativity into the entertainment industry and the commercial field. Let us look forward to these three bright stars shining even brighter in the future. Next news. The current situation of the leading actors of the three daughters of the Xia family is very different. Netizen spicy comments, the characters reflect reality. The 2011 drama has once again topped the hot search list. It's not because of her outstanding appearance, but because the plot is too subversive. Netizens sharply commented that crazy people are acting, fools are watching, and this sentence deeply hurt the hearts of countless post-90s. However, not only did everyone not feel uncomfortable, but they enjoyed it and participated enthusiastically, which is enough to prove the magic of this drama. The situation today is very different from the past. The career development of the three former heroines is different now, and the gap is obvious. 01. Just like in the film and television settings, Tang Yan at that time had already been designated as the real heroine. Whether it was the star treatment she enjoyed at the time or her performance in real life, Tang Yan showed her style as a big heroine. Tang Yan in real life is very similar to Xia Xian Wei in the drama. After experiencing the ups and downs of love, she finally successfully gained happiness, and her career once again reached the peak and went smoothly. In 2001, Tang Yan, who was only 20 years old, won the championship of the national beauty pageant with her outstanding beauty and slender legs. The following year, he was admitted to the performance department of the Central Academy of Drama, and became classmates with Wen Zhang, 
by Bei and Sun Jian. Soon after, Tang Yan, who had not yet graduated, was selected as an Olympic baby and appeared on the stage at the closing ceremony of the Athens Olympics. However, with the two honors of the national beauty pageant champion and Olympic baby, Tang Yan's experience has reached a height that ordinary people can hardly reach. Her good luck continued to the hit drama Legend of Sword and Fairy 3 in her life. Although she was famous at the time, she had not yet made her mark in the film and television industry. Her good friend Hu Jia, who was also from Shanghai, invited her to participate in Legend of Sword and Fairy. Tang Yan agreed to Hu Jie's request without hesitation, and won the title of Ancient Costume Beauty with the role of Zixuan, the descendant of the infatuated Nuwa. Together with Yang Mi and Liu Shishi, she has become the white moonlight in the hearts of countless audiences. Compared with the other two, Tang Yan's status is not enough to be supported by one work. Therefore, in 2011, the three daughters of the Xia family came out and immediately became the hot drama of On Hui Satellite TV. With the success of these two dramas, Tang Yan joined the ranks of stars together with Zhao Lian, who was very popular at the time, and Yang Mi and Liu Shishi of the same period. The four little flowers are now called 85 flowers. Tang Yan not only shines in her acting career, but her emotional experience is also full of twists and turns. After meeting Qiu Yuzhe for the first time in The Three Daughters of the Xia Family, Tang Yan was deeply attracted to him. At that time, Qiu Yuzhe was not only tall and handsome, but also had the identity of a racing driver. The multiple charms overlapped, making Tang Yan unable to extricate herself from it. As the saying goes, some people can only be admired from a distance, but not be approached lightly. Qiu Yuzhe is handsome and unrestrained, but not loyal enough. After the two fell in love for many years, Qiu Yuzhe was exposed to cheating, which caused Tang Yan to be deeply hit. During the relationship, there were endless rumors about Tang Yan making sacrifices for love. This is somewhat similar to the role of Xia Xianmi. Fortunately, Tang Yan was not too sad. She quickly threw herself into work and tried to heal her emotional trauma through work. Tang Yan seemed to have tasted the sweetness of the role of Xia Xianmi. Since then, she has been playing love dramas with silly and sweet roles such as Love Wakes Up, Golden Jade Marriage and Wai Shang Ziyamo. Tang Yan chose a highly homogenized acting path, which did bring her many benefits. Because these roles are highly compatible with her, she can play well in this comfort zone. In Diamond Lover, Tang Yan met her true love Luo Jin by chance. She and Luo Jin developed from friends to lovers, and their married life was even happier. Not only did they welcome the birth of their daughter, but their careers also reached their peak again. In the past 24 years, the popular drama Flower in the Shanghai Circle made the 40-year-old Tang Yan famous again. In the drama, Tang Yan not only performed wonderfully with TV King Hu Jie in Shanghainese, but also successfully portrayed the role of Miss Wang. She is indeed a heroine who has achieved success in both love and career. 02. You used to look down on me, but now I have surpassed your reach. It can be said that this is a true portrayal of Qi Wei. Similar to Xia Laoshan. Kiwei's personality is also very strong. Kiwei was born in Chengdu, Sichuan, and is a Sichuan girl with a hot personality. But such a Sichuan girl had to endure and bow her head in the entertainment industry in her early years, silently bearing the oppression of unspoken rules. Kiwei did not receive professional music training. She majored in welding in college. It was because of her love for singing that she was lucky enough to embark on the career path of a singer. In 2006, Kiwei watched a talent show My Style My Show. Kiwei signed up with the mentality of trying it out. This was her first time going abroad, and she was full of talent and successfully broke into the top 10 in the country. However, the good times did not last long, and the road to music became extremely bumpy. In order to make a living, Kiwei turned her focus to the film and television industry. It was at this time that Kiwei met Yu Zheng, a famous producer at the time. With her fiery personality, she successfully won the role of the equally domineering Princess Gladeo in the play. Originally thought that her acting career would start smoothly, but she suffered a dumb loss in the three daughters of the Xia family. Due to the lack of guidance from professional agents and rich acting experience, Kiwei's second drama faced many challenges. Therefore, Kiwei, like Xia Laoshan, became the character with the thinnest background among the three heroines. Kiwei, who joined the group directly, was arranged in the most difficult time period, and all her personal shots started at 6 o'clock in the morning. Since this time point had been rejected by other artists and written into the contract, only Kiwei knew nothing and followed the crew foolishly. Kiwei, who played the second female in the play,
needed to recite a lot of lines. She started working at 6 in the morning, and after returning to the hotel at 10 in the evening, she still had to continue preparing for the next day's lines, and even did not forget to review them before going to bed. Although the shooting environment was not satisfactory, the character setting was quite attractive and hard to ignore. After playing the role of Xia Yaoshan, Ki Wei successfully opened up a world of her own in the entertainment industry. Later, Ki Wei married Korean actor Lee Shun Hai and quickly returned to the entertainment industry after giving birth to a child. Ki Wei quickly won the love of everyone with her outspoken image in variety shows. After seven years of companionship with her husband Lee Shun Hai, the relationship is still the same, and it has always maintained a harmonious and stable state. Ki Wei also entered into marriage for love. She not only welcomed her own children, but also her career flourished. 03. It should have been a sure win, but it ended up in a mess, and even Yu Zhang couldn't help but be extremely disappointed. Zhang Meng showed netizens through her own experience what the true meaning of not understanding the cherishment until it is lost is. Among the three daughters of the Xia family, Yang's Hen Sun is undoubtedly the purest white moonlight. The tortuous growth process of the character Yang's Hen Sun aptly reflects Zhang Meng's life experience. At that time, Zhang Meng won this role with her outstanding appearance. At the age of 15, Zhang Meng was already graceful and entered the entertainment industry by participating in the movie Golden City 1943. The following year, he was admitted to the Beijing Film Academy, and immediately attracted the attention of the gold medal producer Yu Zhang after graduation. Thanks to Yu Zhang's appreciation, Zhang Meng was fortunate to play a small role in beauty scheming. This role that only appeared for five seconds was the famous Wei Zifu. Zhang Meng was hailed as the most beautiful Wei Zifu, and this title became her first generation label. Yu Zhang personally certified Zhang Meng's beauty, she was destined to become famous because her beauty was unparalleled and she did not need plastic surgery at all. However, Zhang Meng did not take Yu Zhang's words to heart. In Zhang Meng's acting career, there are only a few modern dramas, and Xia Jia Sam Jin Jin is her only successful work. Since then, Zhang Meng has been steadily developing in costume dramas and gradually consolidated her position. With her outstanding appearance in Yu Zhang's favor, Zhang Meng's star path was bright at that time. Before that, Zhang Meng had established her position as the number one sister in Huas with Gu Jian Qitan and the Deer in the Cauldron. At that time, Gu Jian Qitan was a star-studded show, not only bringing together the popular actress Yang Mi at the time, but also the beauties from Hong Kong and Taiwan such as Jillian. Even in such an occasion with so many beauties, Zhang Meng's appearance is still not inferior. Although not the protagonist, the role played by Zhang Meng is not only smart and capable, but also very considerate. Coupled with Zhang Meng's stable and excellent acting skills, this role directly received many praises. Xu Enjur in The Deer and the Cauldron showed her intelligence and thoughtfulness in the same year. With the blessing of these two roles, Zhang Meng has already occupied a place in costume dramas until she met the key turning point in her life Wang Yuan. When Zhang Meng received the role of Wang Yuan, she thought her life would be like Liu Yifri, ushering in a substantial leap. However, reality is not always what people want. Due to the classics before, Zhang Meng's Wang Yuan failed to win the recognition of most people. In addition, the mediocre appearance made the role of Wang Yuan completely degenerate from a fairy-like image to a mundane state. Netizens expressed dissatisfaction and made various criticisms. This dealt a huge blow to Zhang Meng, who has always been confident and generous, and she began to rely on external forces to improve her appearance. Contrary to expectations, the modification originally intended to have icing on the cake unexpectedly caused Waterloo. This had a profound adverse impact on Zhang Meng's subsequent career. Zhang Meng felt deeply regretful at this moment, but there was no cure in the world. At a birthday party, Yu Zhang met Zhang Meng again and was surprised by her appearance. As a producer, Yu Zhang did not dare to use Zhang Men easily even if he could completely rely on personal relationships to choose roles. It can be seen that Zhang Meng had completely reached a dead end at that time. Zhang Meng suffered repeated setbacks in the entertainment industry and had to gradually fade out of the entertainment industry and turn to the internet celebrity world. In the end, she entered the audience's field of vision again through live streaming. Until recently, the audience saw Zhang Meng again in Mo Yu Yun Jian. The former heroine of costume dramas can only play a supporting role without lines in costume dramas now. Whether she can return to the arena again depends on Zhang Meng's luck and strength. In general, plastic surgery is a personal freedom and choice, and the audience's outsiders have no right to interfere.
there is no need to always talk about plastic surgery. Today, Zhang Meng's thinking has become more mature, and she is more stable in handling affairs after marriage. I hope she can turn the tide with more outstanding works in the future. Conclusion In Xia Jia Sab Jin Jin, although Qi Wei started from the lowest point, she made a name for herself in the entertainment industry and variety shows with her own efforts and excellent eloquence. Tang Yan, who has always been steady and cautious, gradually returned to the stage after marriage and still achieved outstanding results. Zhang Meng has gradually explored a new path. I hope she can get better and better in the future. Thank you for watching the video, please leave your opinion in the comments section. Don't forget to press the channel subscription button. If this is the first time you watch a video on the channel,